Catch Akeem, I know you, you let off the, the relay. What did it mean for you to lead off this relay that got the bronze medal today? Well, I was just focused focus on just execute my race and make sure the button run properly. And you know, we are the youngest in the field, and this medal means a lot to us and Jamaica and everyone. So I really put up all of us and myself. Thank you. There you go. And then Antonio Watson, so Watson, so how'd you feel being part of this uh, bronze medal relay here at the World Champs? I you know it means a lot. You know, it's my first uh, international meet. You know, first ever. So for for me to come here and get a medal, you know, it means it means a lot to me. There you go. Really proud of you. And then last one over here. Let's go, Ford. <laughs> How would you feel to, again, be on this uh, Jamaican team, this bronze medal winning team here? I feel really good. It means a lot to me, my family, the whole Jamaica, my teammates, you know, coaches, everyone who's supporting us. And I think we did a tremendous job, so I'm really happy right now. Bronze medal, um, one thing I can say for sure, Jamaica can definitely look out for, uh, for more good, good results in the years to come. Great job out there, man. Good job. And, and just one quick question. I mean, you, you hold the world record in the 4x1. Um, is, is there any pressure with the young guys which oblique um, Akeem to take up the mantle, the likes of Bolt and Blake had set about a decade ago? Um, I wouldn't say there is pressure, but you know, it's just expectations of um, the athletes and of the country. You know, it's always good to break records, but you have to understand and appreciate, appreciate that um, those guys are, are the greats. So, if and when we are able to break the record, that would be really good. I would just have to 